Ever wondered how breast cancer surgery is actually performed? It's one of the most critical steps in treatment, and the approach depends on the cancer's size, location, and stage. The two main surgeries are lumpectomy and mastectomy. In a lumpectomy, the surgeon removes only the tumor along with a small margin of surrounding tissue, aiming to preserve as much of the breast as possible. A mastectomy is more extensive, removing the entire breast, and is chosen when the cancer is larger or more widespread. Before surgery, imaging tests like MRIs or mammograms help the surgical team plan their exact approach. During the operation, precise incisions are made, the tissue is removed, and lymph nodes are often checked to determine whether the cancer has spread. This may involve a sentinel lymph node biopsy or a full axillary dissection. Afterward, the area is closed carefully, and in some cases, reconstructive surgery is done immediately. Recovery varies, but many patients return home within a day. It's a major step, but often a life-saving one.